Spray your 9 by 13 pan and turn the oven to 350. Put 12 eggs and one cup of milk into a bowl and whisk. You can add salt and pepper at that time too. Just eyeball it. Whisk it up. Okay, add some garlic salt, not too much. Like a fourth of a teaspoon. And onion powder, fourth of a teaspoon. And parsley like a fourth of a teaspoon or whatever, whatever for color. I just like to look at it and I think it tastes good in it. Take a half of a large red bell pepper and dice it and a medium onion. I just had white onion and dice that and then put it in the egg mixture and mix again. Okay, so then add to the mixture any breakfast meat like sausage bacon already cooked sausage bacon I have ham that was cooked I'm gonna put in I'm just gonna eyeball what I think the kids will want um, so this has been cooking all day and I took it off the bone and it's so good I was gonna make I might still make some um, bean soup with it but one of them said I don't want bean soup so anyways so mix that up and then it's going to be ready to bake. Okay, so just pour it in the pan. And you want to spread the um, ham around a bit. So it's not all in one spot. Because that kind of will sink to the bottom anyways. It's kind of big. If you do find like bigger chunks and you have little kids, cut it up. Because my one son choked on ham before. So anyways, um, and then I have cheese. Now... This cheese is this kind, and it's gonna expire in a couple days. So I thought, well, I'm just gonna use it. So I have four different cheeses, and I'm kinda of just gonna layer them on, um, like switch them out, put each, each one in a row, kinda of like that, and then bake it for, I'm gonna say 25 minutes. You're gonna to have to watch it yourself and see what you think. Um, when it starts to get brown on top, you're, or once it's done in the middle, you'll want to take it out. And there you go. This is easy. You can use whatever vegetables or meat, cheese. I, I would typically use shredded cheese on this because that's what I usually have. I do have that, but um, you can be creative. It doesn't matter. Pretty much if you put the spices in and the eggs, you can put whatever you want. It's going to taste good.